Little Victory Sports Cards here, and I'm back with another PSA sub-reveal. I'm really excited about this one. I've been waiting, and it finally arrived. Uh, it was part of the July special, $18 value level. And it's actually the counterpart to uh, the other submission about a couple weeks ago that got 86 or 87% gem rate. And... Uh, I'm very excited. It This one also got very high gem rate. I think it was around 70%. So you're going to see a lot of 10s. I'm very happy how it turned out. And I won't waste your time. No more boring talk. Let's get started. There we go. Now, in this order, there was one damaged card that PSA damaged, but at least they caught it. They were aware that they damaged it. Um, I think it was graded a gem 10, but they contacted me and it got a, after the damage, got a PSA 5. So I told them, don't even encapsulate it. Just send me the refund for the grading fee and the declared value, which they did, which was fine. But my only problem was that because of that little incident, um, it took longer for them to ship out the order. I think it took like an extra three weeks. In my opinion, if it, the damage is caused on their end, they should ship really fast, right? Get it out to you because they feel bad. But I'm not going to complain too much because the grades were amazing. And uh, let's see what we got. All right. First card is a... Dylan Brooks, he's having a pretty good career for the Grizzlies. Um, again, he was an Oregon Ducks player, so I'm a fan. This one actually didn't get a 10. I Pre-grade was a 10. But, like I said, I, I shouldn't complain about this order. Um, this is Steph Curry, 2012. Past and present, reigning threes. I mean, he's probably the greatest three-point shooter of all time. He got a gem 10. Uh, 2012, first year of Prism Basketball. This is a Kobe Bryant. It was off-center, you can tell. I thought I knew it was going to get a 9. I'm happy with that one. Uh, I got some football already. This is a Derrick Henry. He's picking it up this year. Getting a touchdown now in every game. This is the Press Proof Blue Donruss rookie year. Uh, not numbered, but good-looking card. Um, this one... I thought it would get a 10, actually, but it got a 9. These ones are hard to grade. Uh, we got a 2008 Tom Brady Own the Game insert. I got a gem 10. All right. Next up is a 2019 Tom Brady Disco Prism. It got a 9. This one I knew would get a 9. If you can see the line, little factory line right there. So I'm okay with that one. 2020 Tom Brady Green Prism. He got a 10. Centering looked pretty good. All around. Good looking card. A 2018 Tom Brady. The red, white, and blue. Uh, I got a 9. This one I think also had a little print defect. So the pre-grade was a 9 on that one. Next one, I, he's having a rough start to the year. Um, I mean, the Colts are in general. But I thought he would have another great year. Uh, 2020 Mosaic, Jonathan Taylor, Reactive Orange, got a 10. Well, this is a fun card. This, I think this probably has a low pop. Uh, it's hard to find these centered and no greening, which is no greening, and it's centered. It's a two, uh, 1996 Top Chrome Griffey. It's not his base, it's the star power kind of version within the set. Um, yeah, it's a good looking card. Next up is a 1997 Barry Larkin Refractor Tops Chrome. I like the firework background and the shine to this card. It's an all-star version. I mean, he's one of the best, best shortstops. Here you go. 
Uh, Clayton Kershaw, 2007, Bowman Chrome. This one, actually, I had a pretty grade of a 9. I just, for some reason, I didn't like the centering, but now that I look at it, it's, it's pretty decent. There you go. I hope he has a good postseason this year. This is a 96 Leaf Limited Mike Piazza Lumberjacks. I always loved this set growing up. They were hard to pull uh, out of 5,000, which back in the day was very rare for the times. And I got a gem 10. Happy with that one. I am a Freddie Freeman fan. I PC him. He's had such a great career. You know, I, Mike Trout gets all the love and the value in the hobby, but people like Freddie Freeman, he's had, in my opinion, almost just as good a career. Longevity-wise, he might outlast Trout and everything. Uh, I got a... This is his first year Bowman, 2007. Gem 10. Uh, Matt Carpenter, I haven't... He was having a good start to the year, I think. I haven't looked him up in a while. Um, this one, extremely hard to grade. But I sent it in because it was so nice. You can see. I don't know why they gave this one a 9, but that's okay. It's the 2011 purple. Matt Carpenter. Obama. I like presidential cards. This is the 2009 Goodwin champ. I don't think it's his like, official rookie. I think Topps had a candidate version in 2008. But this is the mini version. Gem 10. I like it. I, I, you know, I bet it sells for 150 Somewhere around there. Maybe 200 even. Uh, 2012 Mike Trout. This one had a little factory line. See it right there, pretty clear. So I'm happy with a nine. I actually pre-graded as an eight because of that line. But other than that, it looked great. It's uh, Prism 2012. Yay, Aaron Judge. I'm glad I have a couple Aaron Judge cards in this order. Uh, it was a little heavy on the right side. I had an outside chance at a 10. Um, it, everything else looked great, but he got a nine. And I should probably sell that pretty quick while it's hot. This is the 2016 Vanity Donruss. Tom Brady, Legends of the Fall. Got a 10. Devin Hester. I'm a fan of collecting his stuff right now because he will be a Hall of Famer. Amazing punt returner, wide receiver. He did it all. This is his Fleer Futures version. All right, let's keep it rolling. Here's a nine. Got a little fingerprints there. Uh, 2012 Tops Chrome. Um, all these I pre graded as a 10. I, I sent the best of the best in. Uh, 2012, this is a prestige league leaders. I just was a fan of the big names on this one Brady, Stafford, Rogers, Breeze, Gem 10. 2012 Tom Brady, Gem 10. Tops Chrome. Gem 10. This one I'm happy with. Over the years, I just kind of hoard all the Tom Brady commons, and this was in my Tom Brady commons box. And I was happy to find this parallel. It's a really nice rainbow black version. I mean, look at the shine to that. For not being like a chrome card, it's, it's a great looking example here. And I got a Gem 10, so I'm very happy with that one. I, I don't know the value exactly, but I imagine it's close around 400, maybe even. Uh, this is DeAndre Hopkins. I'm excited for him to get back, get suited up. So Kyler has someone more to throw to. It's the Spectra Rookie Revolution. I think these are numbered out of 99. There you go. You got a gem 10. Uh, 2013, Topps Chrome, Tom Brady. Gem 10. We're on a roll now. Uh, 2014, Aaron Donald. I mean, a Hall of Fame lock, and he's still playing, so gem 10 on this one. 2014, Tom Brady. Gem 10. Tops. 2013, National Convention Set. This got a gem 10. Uh, let's 
let's see. Devontae Adams, Topps Chrome Rookie, Gem 10, 2014. Uh, they just lost this week, but he played against Brady, so I kind of knew he was going to lose. Um, another Oregon Duck. I'm a fan of him. I'm glad he had a chance to start somewhere this year. I think the Falcons are 2-3. and three. He hasn't been looking great, which is disappointing, but that's okay. I'm still cheering him on, and will always be a fan of his. It's the 2015 Contenders Mariota Auto, PSA 10. Uh, 2014 Tom Brady, Top Chrome. Gem 10. Uh, Stefan Diggs. I had a lot of these in my last order, too. Uh, this is a purple refractor. Gem 10. Another 2014 Top Chrome Base. Tom Brady. Gem 10. Oh, good. Another Diggs. This is the refractor version. Uh, Gem 10. 2015 Tom Brady. Gem 10, Prism. Cooper Cup. He's quietly putting together another record-setting year. I'm surprised he's not getting a little more hobby love. It's it's insane what he's doing. Uh, Gem 10, this is Prism Introductions version. Uh, another Diggs. This is the Mini. Uh, I'm not a fan how they did the Mini that year. Uh, this is a Diamond Refractor version. Stefan Diggs, PSA 10. Not numbered. Uh, like in my last videos, I PC these. It's the Stranger Things TV show. 2018 Tops is the first year they made the Stranger Things cards. And, but this is the Waffle version. I only collect the Waffle version. They're numbered out of 11. Very hard to find. I was buying these for around 30 bucks each, but they've ballooned now to around 90 to 100 each. Um, which is understandable how rare they are, how popular the show is. This one got gem 10, signs of a struggle. Keep that one out. You will not be seeing that one for sale. I gotta try to complete that set, it's gonna take me a while. All right, ooh, I like the top one. Another great week, Josh Allen. I think he's the MVP so far, in my opinion. I mean, he's got to be him or Hertz so far. Uh, it's the certified gold team rookie, PSA 10. Uh, this is the 2009 Matthew Stafford Comics. It's his rookie year from Topps Kickoff. We got a gem 10. 2007 Tom Brady, SP Authentic base gem 10 uh like i said in the the counterpart video of the other submission i had a whole case of these um that i pulled the brady's out and i think everyone has gotten a 10 you'll see about six more of these in here it's uh the contenders 2006 gem 10 um this is 2006 fleer tom brady fantasy standouts gem 10 that one's got to be a low pop. Look at all the dark, dark borders. Uh, same, 2006, Gem 10. Oh, my first eight. Um, I also had about 12 of these, and I picked the best ones to send in. And they did not do well. The last one got a nine. This one got an eight. And these are the best of the best. Really. I mean, dark borders, dark edges. But look. It's nice and sharp. I'm not sure what they saw in that one. But, you know, low value base cards, not worth cracking and resending in. So I'll just keep it. Uh, 2007 Tom Brady, Bowman Chrome, PSA 10. Uh, this is the silver holofoil version. I think it's numbered, a high number, but it's numbered. Yeah, out of 1349. 2008 Matt Ryan, kickoff rookie card. Not having a great year. <laughs> it's okay. Um, Matthew Stafford, 2009, Topps Magic, Gem 10. Uh, Joe Montana, good to see one of the old-time greats here. Uh, 2016, Donner's Elite Teal version, Gem 10. Numbered out of 90, no, 75. 
Um, let's see, we got DJ Moore, another guy not having a great year. I mean, he's on the Panthers and has Baker thrown to him, so he's not going to go very high this year. Uh, number 35, this is Gold Zone from Honors, PSA 10, rookie. Another Stafford, it's the Topps Mayo. If I remember, these backs are gold, so they can probably get a lot of chipping. Yeah, so this one's going to be hard to gem. You can kind of see right there in the corner. We got him at nine. The two goats in one card, tails and ten. Gridiron lineage. Out of ten. Uh, classics, Stafford, tails and nine. Rookie, PSA ten. I think these are numbered out of nine ninety nine. Yep, I'm happy with that grade. Gem ten. 2010 Topps Chrome Tom Brady's. Out of all the Topps Chrome base, this is like one of the harder ones to gem, in my opinion. There's a lot of centering issues and little surface flaws. And you really need to clean these ones, wipe them down. Um, This guy, I thought he would play this year. I don't know. Him and Odell, I think they still have some life in them. I'm not sure what happened. It's the T.Y. Hilton. 2012 Prism should be a Colts fan favorite. It's the green version, PSA 10. Uh, 2010 Tom Brady Base. Number 30. Gem 10. Keep rolling. Another box. card the Geno Atkins rookie like I said in the previous videos I, I get tens on these and they're surprisingly valuable they don't have his rookie logo on this card but I think this is known as his rookie got gem 10 uh 2018 Steph Curry silver version of the dominance I got a gem 10 really happy with that one all right we're getting into basketball 2018 LeBron James, red, white, and blue prism. These just don't sell like they used to. I mean, they're so mass produced, those years of prism. Uh, there we go. This guy's actually heating up. It's weird to say, but his gem tens of these prism base, Zion, is, are worth more than Ja Morant. And Ja Morant has proven himself way more. I think the Ja itself for around 200, and these maybe. 250 275 there you go i'm happy with that cade we got a cade donris rated rookie gem 10 uh junior seau 1997 it's the artist proof version i got a nine those ones were hard to pull um, 1997, Marcus Allen, Refractor, Thunder and Lightning. It got a 9. This one, I hey, pre-graded as a 10. I didn't, there was nothing wrong with it. But, like I said, you guys have seen how many 10s I've got. So, just tell me to shut up from complaining. Uh, this is the 1999 John Elway, Refractor Preview from Stadium Club Chrome. Um, this one was flawless centering and surface everything except for i did see a little tint of green to it i think maybe that's what they saw but got a nine uh dwight freeney another guy that'll be in the hall of fame soon uh 2002 pristine gem 10 numbered out of 499 so that should sell pretty well down the road uh, 2002, I love seeing 2002 Brady's Gem 10. This is the UD Authentics. Looks like the 1989 Baseball Upper Deck Gem 10. This one, the pre-grade was a 9. The centering's heavy on the right. You can see that. But it looked great other than that. So I'm okay with a 9 there. Uh, 2003 Flares. I'm liking these older Brady's getting Gem Pens. Um... Happy with that one. 
2002 honor roll, Tom Brady. This one got a 9. Again, it, it was a pretty great of a 10. It was sharp. Uh, this one probably has to be hard to grade. But look, look how nice that one was. Maybe some white, touch of white. But it was a very clean copy. Look at that. Got a 9. 2004 SPX. More Aaron Donald. Tops Chrome, Gem 10. Uh, Devin Hester. This one was a 9. We got a 10 earlier on that one. Uh, 2005 Tops Tom Brady, Gem 10. I like the looks of this card. 2005 Tops Heritage, Tom Brady, Gem 10. Uh, just more contenders, 2006, Gem 10, Brady. Um, 2006, Top Space, Tom Brady, Gem 10. All right, we're cruising. Okay. This one, I think, has the damage card I mentioned earlier. I think it was a Bo Cruz. <laughs> One. Okay. Uh, 2006 Ed Reed, Red Refractor. This one got a mint nine. Um, pretty good was a 10 on this. Number got a 259. Or else I probably wouldn't have sent it in. But I still like the look of this card a lot. Uh, I don't do a lot of NASCAR. I don't do really any of it. But... When there was nothing available other than NASCAR and wrestling, all those, you know, the blaster boxes at Target, I went ahead and bought a few of hockey or NASCAR just to rip some. And I pulled this amazingly out of a blaster. I think it's a number out of 10. I don't know much about him. I think he's decent on the, whatever you call it, circuit. Uh, I, I thought it'd gem 10 for sure, but he got a 9. William Byron. Um, this one, if you guys watch my past videos, you know I love this card. You can see some white there. Um, but I've been getting lucky, getting 10s on them. And I got an 8 on this one. They saw something I didn't. Uh, this one, I'm very excited about. It's probably my favorite card in the order. I mean, it has Jordan and Tiger Woods together golfing. It's a 2014 SP Authentic. This card, I sent in economy level to get graded probably, I don't know, six months ago for 50 bucks and it got an eight. I'm not kidding, same card, same card. I didn't even clean it or anything. I just cracked it out because I was so mad I got an eight. It, I mean, it looks amazing. And I just put it directly back into a penny sleeve holder and sent it back in a value order and it got a 10. It was a 10, I, I, I'm not even kidding, I don't know why. I remember that order got the worst grades. But now look, but they shouldn't be two grades off. Are you kidding me? But they got a 10. That's where it should be. Uh, Tyreek Hill, uh, purple optic rookie, gem 10. Uh, 2016, they should have a good year on the Hawks. This is Murray, DeJounte Murray startups. This one's extremely hard to grab at the low pop. I mean, look at all the dark. It's a thicker card. So the thicker case. It got a mint nine. There's the damage card. I want to see where it got damaged. Um, so it knocked it to a five. Do you guys see it? There. It has to be that, right? The whole edge. It must have been when they're encapsulating it. But it's not that bad. It's a knock to a five. Either way, this was the Bo Cruz Hernan Gomez out of 49 Prism Auto. Uh, okay, keep going. LeBron James. This one's very hard to grade. It had a touch of white on one of the corners. I was hopeful it might get a 9, but it got an 8. 2004, second year, old truck, old medallion. I love that photo. Uh, I had one of these in my last order, a gem too. 
the Helmet Heroes, Emmett from 98. Always good to get a gem 10 on a die cut. Uh, let's see, Devontae Adams. This is his rookie die cut, Tops Chrome. Rookie year, PSA 10. This one, I had the same card in it. Got a gem 10 on the last order. This one got a 9. Diamond Cuts. You must have saw something on the edge. Understandable. This one, I loved the color match on this. The red die cut. I mean, Select has way too many prism parallel colors, in my opinion. But this is just one of the many. But, like I said, I like the color match. Red. 2020 Select Mahomes, PSA 10. This one I'm happy with. To Jim, a 1997 Ultra Barry Bonds Home Run King. I don't agree with that. <laughs> um, it'll always be Hank Aaron, in my opinion. But there you go, you got a Gem 10. Uh, oh, nice. Josh Allen. Uh, absolute introductions, Gem 10. I mean, that's probably a $400 card. It's hot right now. Uh, let's see, Justin Jefferson, another great year. I think I'm going to PC him. I, I love his start to his career and how good he is. Um, 2020, Prism Laser version, Gem 10. Oh, not a good time to get this card back, but I'm happy you got a 10. These ones are very hard to grade this year, especially the silvers. Um, it, this is the Jonathan Taylor. Gem 10. All right, one more. One more to go. I think it went pretty fast through all this. Okay. More 2006 Tom Brady contenders. Gem 10s. Another one. Uh, here's a Mint 9. This one, if I remember correctly, had one surface line. You can kind of see it. So I pre-graded it was a 9. And I got a 9. It's the Prism version of Mahomes' rookie year. Uh, this one I'm happy with. I was just going through some of my old inventory and I saw a set. 96 top set. And usually I always pull the Kobe out, but it was sitting there for 20 years. And uh, I was happy to find it. it. It centering is off and it had a little corner ding. I thought, uh, honestly, I thought maybe a 7. But it got an 8. So I'm happy with it. I know this card's dropped a lot, but I still like it. It's iconic, the photo. Um, I, This is a 97. Jordan is also another card that dropped a lot, but it'll it'll climb back up just because of how popular this photo is and the design is incredible. Uh, yeah, this one is a pre-grade of an 8. You can see the white there. Other than that, it looked great. Jordan, Metal Universe, 97. This one was a crack out. A few crack outs, actually. I'm determined to get a 10 on this. It's so nice. One time it got an 8, and one time it got a 9, and now it's back in a 9. I guess you can see a little white there. But other than that, it was so nice. So I guess it is a 9. I'd say a 9. I'm going to leave it this time. No more crack on that one. Um, I'm a Blazer fan. Um, this is a 2006 Top Scrum, Brandon Roy, man, he was incredible, fan favorite, I just wish his career would have been longer, it's, it's really a shame, I honestly think he could have been a Hall of Famer, number out of 199, the Refractor, Top's Chrome, um, my pre-grade was a 9, I just graded because I, I'm gonna keep this card, probably, uh, there you go, he, gosh, he hit so many game winners, uh, 2007, Gold version, so I was happy to see that. It got a gem 10. Tom Brady. Uh, this card I actually pre graded as a 10, and that's saying something because it's impossible to gem these, uh, mainly because of the back. The corners get ding chipped so easily. But look at this card. Nothing. I, I, I don't know what they saw. It's number out of 999. Ricky Rubio, he'll be back. Probably in December. Should play pretty well uh, for the Cavs. Mid-9. Because uh, I'm a Blazer fan. I mean, he's a solid center in the league. And, you know, he's not the greatest, but he's a solid center. Uh, Nurkic, 
2014 Silver Prism, Gem 10. Here's an Otani Bowman Rookie, PSA Gem 10. All right, another Judge. Hurry and list that one on eBay. It's the Alan Ginter, 2017, Gem 10. Uh, 2015 Tom Brady Base, Tops Chrome, Gem 10. Again, I got I got hammered on these. And these are the same style copy, same condition as the other ones I sent in in the last submission, and they got 10s. Uh, so I don't know what they're doing on these. I know their value have dropped a lot, and they are pretty mass-produced this year. But these got 8s. But they're much nicer than 8s, trust me. They had chances at 10s. Here's one that got a 9. But no 10s on the Tiger Woods upper decks. Uh, 2013 tops. 1969 green variation. This one has to be a low pop. Look at this. It, no chipping. Nothing. Oh, and a black back border. Yeah. I imagine this is very low pop. DeAndre Hopkins, PSA 10. There we go. Here's some more PC cards. The Stranger Things Waffle. This one's going in circles. Got a gem 10. I was number one out of 11. I was four for four on these. I sent in four and got four gem 10s through the lights. There's Winona Ryder there. Two out of 11. Uh, there's more Winona Ryder missing. Gem 10, Waffle Variation. 11 out of 11. I hope you enjoyed this video. Comment below with any suggestions or anything.